Hello friends, Arthur here and this is ZSL Season 4, Round 3 I guess? Uh, fixed checkpoints, round review. As usual, first time slot hosted by Akane. And as of round, I like usually have some goals before I like finish in top 10, top 16 at least several times. This time, nothing. Well, just one, at least finish all tracks, because when I review them, when I play them, there weren't a lot of track to choose for ZSL this time, and most of them were quite hard, and I, even in normal condition, I have a lot of problem on some of this track to finish them, and it take way longer than 7 minutes. But this day I have really great excuse for today. Uh, so I have steering wheel for other racing games. I really love racing. So, yeah. And um, one of the pedal started like squishing, squeaking, made some noise that it's not supposed to make. So uh, I don't know why, but I decided to do it like prior ZSL and uh, take oil in a can and trying to spray inside of this pedal for like basically to stop squeaking and I don't know how it's happened and why it's happened but it basically sprayed back into my face right in my left eye so uh, not really great experience and it was like 20 minutes before the SL itself and yeah like obviously i washed my eye and tried to do something like uh have some kind of eardrops but oh it still was hurting and now i'm look like this but not so handsome and not so old but well honestly i don't know how old he was during this film but uh, sorry sorry i digressed so during this round i'm like almost blind on my left eye and it's pain and it's itchy and it's so distractful so i have like great excuse to have a bad result this time another reason there were so many other players like i didn't saw so many players on zsl for a long time at least at first time slot at maximum it was like 40 41 at the same time so pretty big room and it was great, a lot of really strong players, a lot of new names, so I love when all these contests are become more popular and the game itself. But as of tracks, as I said, some of them were so heavy for me, like just finishing them, some tracks like I finished just once and I was like really really happy to do so. For several tracks I even don't beat my like personal best so yeah quite hard but because there were a lot of people some tracks was easier because i could watch how like other players finish them like rooted outlook by codewalt ah i saw like ajix doing the last turn into the last checkpoint into the finish and it helped me to be slightly faster and yeah it's basically help. Another example, it's track from Lazy Kidna. I believe Lexer helped me. I was just behind him. He basically showed me the perfect line. And well, uh, it, it still wasn't like the best, but <laughs> it was better than my personal result. And once more, a story that I may be like jumping from one team to another. Uh, because even when I'm like recording it right, basically right after the round itself, just record it as fast as I can, because I don't know, maybe tomorrow I will need to go to the doctor. Um, yeah, it's still painful and in my eyes, so um, yeah, sorry. It's hard to concentrate even after the round itself, and maybe I will be saying it several times, so sorry once again, but back to the tracks. For a car's track, I, this is one of the um, tracks that I really love because I really love this style, even if I'm not really like great 
on them, but it is fun, it is nice, it is really interesting to drive it. Several attempts were like really great for me, but at the end a lot of people were improving a lot, so yeah, not nothing too proud. But as I said, at least I beat my personal best and still beat a gold medal and was way closer to the after medal, which honestly I'm like not really can achieve it on all such technical tracks because I'm very inconsistent on my steering and even with like action key I can't be really consistent. Yes, I'm not losing traction, but I can do the same trajectory over and over. And yeah, I know it's my skill problem. And honestly, I don't know how to fix it. On Ghost Lightning from Lilizaban, I finished, I believe, just twice. And both of them were quite like lucky finishers. And I do all this track almost like fine until the last jump into the finish i missed several times and several times i didn't have enough speed so i completely like crashing on the track prior it so yeah it wasn't nice but i really love all this barrel roll and spiral jumps uh, in the end what you can do during the landing and finishing it so this was fun part what track i really love it was like flower power from diabler even if it was like really colorful and slightly distracting in that but somehow i was pretty good at it not the best you know not top 10 but still good a lot of consistent finishes a lot of really nice consistent driving so why not feeling great oh one more thing i forget that this time there was just Maki, Ajax, like a lot of really great players and it was really nice to see them and how they take part and finish and really nice. Also thanks to Akane who built like really nice break level. As usual he creates this new feature not like in previous like three seasons or other stuff so he create one big track and just adding new portion each time when new round came so thanks this time it was great even if i have a lot of problem to finish it and even if i could finish like the breaking level i thought okay it will be really hard and usually i'm like near the arcana like several places up several down but we are really close to each other so it is good reference points for me to understand did I'm doing like better or do I or I'm doing like bad this time and looking that at soundtrack I kind of doing like 20 20 fives it really shows how tracks are really hard and I believe it was the, one of the hardest rounds from what I play for like last four seasons during this round I watched uh, Ronan and Akana stream and remember how many complaints was from Ronan. He was complaining on Tatooine track where he was crashing during the jump where you need to go through the building. You need to have a lot of speed and because you have a lot of speed you can like really miss this jump or basically hit the wall. Nothing strange here, right guys? This track as I said, it's snowy, it's hard, but at least the really hard part on this track is the right, correct jump into the last checkpoint. It's blind, so you need to be really precise to do it. And I was lucky enough to do it pretty damn good. So P16, fine, again. And honestly, this time I noticed that second part after breaking level was slightly better than the first one which usually completely opposite i'm doing best results on the first part and then doing really bad at the second one um feature twist was one of the tracks that i really love it was nice and flowy as thanks to weak racer and diabler who give me really great advice on 
in the comments about how to approach this track that you need to go and take higher line near the end which basically give you more speed uh, so yeah it's really helped it's really give me some extra time even if i did like 27s i guess but in general it was nice it give me a lot of it give me a better time so thanks for your comments and again guys if you have some advice some suggestions just leave them in the comments i read all of them maybe not like right away because well real life you know all this stuff so not always near the, my computer what i really love in lexer track or not love but find out that i was forced to use like 100 percent of steering which usually i'm doing like 80 and it's give me a lot of maneuverability it's not like making me lose traction so usually it's way better for me this time because of all these like really sharp turns well i they not like seems like sharp turns but at the end they become one and like doing like snails and i was forced using 100 percent of steering and yeah hard. and i still don't know in what or how i can choose order for all these tracks how he build them what he need to do to like build them up it's not like from difficulty at least not from my level of difficulty like from easiest to hardest it's not by alphabetical order it's just i don't know but i think there still should be some pattern and it's again not like the order of when there was submitted all this level there are still like from different times and like one of them could be on the first position could, could be submitted last or something like that so yeah i still wonder how it builds uh, but each time i have this question during like round itself and then i forget until the next round and always forget to just write it down in discord to account and asking him how is there some pattern is there some logic to building up all this track or building up their orders um there are things that you can see or i notice that all these tracks or all this round there wasn't like really consistent for me there was like big gaps i believe one or two tracks i finished in like top 16 which was like as i said like big surprise for me and one of them was like uh like penultimate level and i thought maybe because it was like almost the end of the CSL and people like leaving because for some time zones it could quite late but then it was 42 on the like track number 14 32 players which as i said previously one of the highest numbers players on time slot one so yeah it just maybe i could say that this track fit for me but honestly it not it was so hard so destructive for me so all these mesh plates yeah it was hard and i'm saying that i was like all over the place because i like uh track the last track from saint nicholas and ken cop i was so bad that honestly i believe i like at the last moment i beat like 47 seconds so at least i get a bronze medal on the track which was really hard and surprisingly hard for me so yeah uh thanks anyway uh hope you enjoy this short review for the sl season 4 fix it checkpoints uh even if it was tough i really enjoyed it uh yes i was nervous during the round itself especially when you don't have any like finishes for like four minutes on the track so yeah quite annoying hard but after when you done at least all tracks once and you finish in them it still feels nice even if all these tracks were quite hard hope next time it wasn't be so hard and there will be more track to choose from so thanks for watching uh, leave comments uh, vote for the tracks and see you next time bye